my name is Smith and this is a Monday Morsel. Today we're going to talk about service by publication. In order to present your matter before a court, the defendant in your case must be served with the legal documents to initiate the case. These documents include your summons and your complaint. Being served is the legal term for informing the defendant that he or she has a legal matter that needs to be heard. Essentially, serving the defendant gives them notice of the proceedings so they can defend themselves in the action. Since this is important, North Carolina only allows certain ways for a defendant to be served. These ways include personal delivery, which is often called service by sheriff, registered or certified mail, the defendant can accept service, a designated delivery service such as UPS, or as a last resort, you can look to service by publication. A key component for serving a defendant by delivery methods such as sheriff or mail is that you actually have the defendant's current address. If the defendant can't be located at the place they live, service isn't proper and the courts will not accept it. A defendant in a civil action who's not properly served can file a motion for insufficient service of process. This gets the entire case dismissed. To avoid such harsh realities, if you don't have the defendant's address, you can go as a last resort and serve them by publication. When you serve a defendant by publication, you're providing notice of the proceeding by publishing it in a qualified newspaper. Before you can attempt service by publication, there are several rules that must be followed. First, you have a duty to do everything reasonable to locate the party's address. This can include searching the defendant's address online, checking with the Department of Motor Vehicles, asking for friends and family for the person's address. You can even hire a private investigator to locate the defendant. After the plaintiff has done everything reasonable to locate the defendant, they can publish the notice of the proceeding in the newspaper. Second, the notice of proceeding must be published once a week for three consecutive weeks in a newspaper that's qualified for legal advertising. It is critical that the newspaper is one that is circulated in the area that the defendant is believed to be located. Or if that information is not available, it has to be published in the county where the action is pending. In the publication itself, there are certain requirements that have to be met, and it's a pretty detailed list. Lastly, once you've published the appropriate notice in the newspaper for the three consecutive weeks, you need to file an affidavit of due diligence. In this affidavit, it must state that the publication and mailings were both in accordance with the service by publication rules. It also gives the circumstances warranting service by publication. Lastly, if any, it has to provide information regarding the location of the defendant to be served. Once again, service by publication is the last resort notice method. It involves a complex legal rule and requires many delicate steps. If you're a person that needs to serve someone in a legal matter and cannot locate them, it's best to consult with a competent attorney before attempting to do service by publication on your own. If you have more questions, you can reach out to us at www.smithoaminas.com and we'll be happy to help.